now your ABC7 First Alert weather forecast with meteorologist John Scalzi. So we're looking at a uh, air temperature coming in at 83 degrees with a dew point value of 60. That's still very comfortable. Start off the morning with dew points in the in the, in the upper 50s, which was you know, exquisitely comfortable, but 60 you can't complain about. And we have an east wind, which should keep that dew point value down just a little bit. Winds elevated a little bit southeast now at about 14. That 14 mile an hour wind, 10 to 15 throughout the afternoon, should keep the sea breeze pretty close to the coast and not allow for a whole lot of cooling to take place. We'll see a passing cloud from time to time, but really that's about it. The, the good news is that, uh, that the air temperature will feature uh, some lower relative humidity in the afternoon as well at time of maximum heating. And so even though the temperature is going to be about 5 degrees above the average for this time of year, maybe even a little bit more, we're really not going to feel muggy per se today or really most of this week I don't think 87 degrees the air temperature at 3 p.m. by 7 p.m. and an 82 a comfortable 82 by the way and then as we head into the evening some pretty nice sleeping weather I think when you wake up tomorrow morning 65 degrees and again dew points will probably fall off into the uh, low 60s or upper 50s the future cast hour by hour through the day takes you with an easterly wind flow consistent and temperatures that climb into the upper 80s we have some showers coming in from the other coast most likely an onshore wind flow might trigger a shower or two anywhere in this green zone but you'll notice as we progress through the day that kind of dampens out in the center part of the country before it ever a uh, center part of the state before it ever makes it into our area so don't expect to see much in the way of any kind of rainfall today temperatures fall into the 60s overnight and then we're left with a pretty nice couple of days under the influence of that high pressure ridge along the Atlantic coast stormy back to the west when that happens when it's stormy in the west it's usually pretty nice in the east and that's what's going on with us easterly wind flow will continue through a couple more days with showers and a few thunderstorms down to the south of us but really I think in our neck of the woods we stay sunny warm right straight through today through the remainder of the week and that east week will continue so the forecast looks like this. We'll have a east wind coming in at 5 to 10 today. We'll have a daytime high that tops out mild in the uh, 80s, and that is true again tomorrow. As we head through the rest of the week, temperatures remain warm, and we have a front coming through on Sunday that will knock our temperature down a few degrees, but really not much. We'll stay in the uh, above average zone right straight into the beginning of next work week.